Ba -bum, bum. Is this DMCA? Mm, 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 mm. Bing, bing, bing. Away. This is probably DMCA. Installation progress, 27%. Uh-oh. Did you get all that? Confirm. I agree. I confirm what this one do. Agree to that. Agree to this. You can now have access to the time machine. It can be used after you've completed the main story. Is the time machine the DLC? You can now change the beat, the music that plays in battle and on the field from the options menu. A random feature has been added to the BGM settings. An auto advanced feature for text has been added. This feature automatically advances conversations. Villainous Mira will now appear in the game. You must progress through the villainous enemy event to fight him. I don't even I forgot who Mira was. Cards, sleeves, and playmats have been added to Dragon Ball Card Warriors. Wait, there's a card game in this game? <laughs> Alright, a new search feature has been added to Deck Filter in the Dragon Ball Card Warriors. Features to dismantle all access cards and to skip card creation animations have been added to Dragon Ball Card Warriors. Man, I sure unlocked a whole lot for starting the game. I didn't even, they didn't even start it yet. You can now adjust controller settings from the options menu. Latest update adds in-game purchases and users interact. Checking available add-ons. Music compilation pack has been added to the store. Checking more. You received aged wild steak. You can do your items in your own item menu. You received steaming hot grilled fish. A new Power Awakens Part 1 has been obtained. We got it. A new Power Awakens Part 2 has been obtained. Trunks, the Warrior of Hope. Isn't that the movie? That's the movie, right? Trunks, the Warrior of Hope. You can enjoy the first part of the story while the game is installing. Once the game is installed, you'll have access to the full story. Dragon Ball Card Warriors is an online card game in which you battle an opponent using Dragon Ball card character cards. When he kills the androids in his timeline, you know one aren't go on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Collect cards and build a deck. All your own take players. This looks like nothing like the real life cards. Uh, collect cards, build a deck. All your own and take players from around the world. Accessing the game. You can access the title screen from the card game machine or the main game. Card game machines can be found in a variety of towns, so if you're itching to play at the card game, make your way to town. By collecting cards or progressing through the main story, you earn items for Dragon Ball Card Warriors. These items can be claimed from within the Dragon Ball Card Warriors game, not the main game. 
Okay. All right, so I can start it. Said I said it's like I do part one. It's gonna install while I play part one, though, right? Wait, subtitles? Oh, too late. We're gone. It's not. Why come subtitles aren't default? Or why don't I ask you beforehand like other games? In this world exist seven mystical orbs known as Dragon Ball orbs. Any who should attain all seven is granted anything in their heart desires. Yeah, I knew that. Whatever. We'll switch it when we get a time. So you're gonna have to deal with the first scene without subtitles. Dad? Where's a good place for me to, for me to go? Pick a wall. Pick a wall. Pick a low. Pick a low. You came. My ride. I like to do a little image training every now hey, and then. Hey, the make subtitles. Sure I don't get too rusty. Time to see what I can do. And you're just the guy to help me do that. Controls, guard, L2 square, burst, move, move up down, uh, boost, clicking the stick is super boost, uh, Kai, square is Kai blast, charge Kai, surge, melee, step. Battle control. L1 super attack palette. Oh, okay, I see it over there. L2 for vanish attack. Item palette. R1 for support palette. Transformation palette. Switch targets. As you take damage or deal it out, your tension gauge will fill. When both your tension gauge and Kai are full, hold the triangle to activate the surge effect. While surge is active, all of your stats are boosted. You'll be able to perform unique attacks and cancel super attacks and combos into other actions, as well as automatically chase after and knock back opponents. The surge effect gives you freedom to chain together attacks you normally can't chain together, as well as do things like fire off multiple command commands one after another. I'm guessing that I haven't been training hard enough. Do you think this is some sort of game? Is there perfect blocking? Send it send it back.
I got an S. I did it. I don't know if I actually seen the the end of Dragon Ball. I don't remember. Like I know Piccolo was a bad guy, but I don't think I remember watching the fight. <laughs> Not much longer before this planet's ours. It would have been ours much sooner if you'd actually done your job, Raditz. Uh, sorry. And that's why everyone calls you Raditz the Runt. Things will be different on the next planet. <laughs> Mark my words, if you screw up again, I will kill you. Wait, I just remembered something. I think my little brother Kakarot was sent to a different planet. I'll bet he's still there. You have a brother? I didn't think there were any Saiyans left besides us. If he joins us, the rest of the universe will be ours in no time. The fact that he's your brother doesn't exactly fill me with confidence. What planet was he sent to? Uh, I think it's called Earth. Now that I think about it, I haven't heard anything about him taking control of it. Damn that Kakarot, what the hell is he doing? Attack of the Saiyans. Were they like born and raised on different planets? Dad? Yeah, I'll go. Dad, we better head home or mom's gonna be really mad at us. Sorry for getting a bit carried away, Gohan. I was fighting somebody super strong. Super strong? Yeah, a guy going by the name of Piccolo. Piccolo? Yeah, well, he used to be called Demon King Piccolo. And he was real bad to the bone. He's the strongest guy I've ever fought in my whole life. I don't think anybody's gotten me more pumped up than him. I want to fight him again. So I'm hoping to get stronger. And soon. I'd be afraid to fight someone like that. <laughs> you know, I bet you'd be just fine if you trained yourself up a bit. I don't think Mom would like that very much. Ah, that's right. I totally forgot that Chi Chi asked us to get some ingredients for her. How could I not remember that? Because you don't remember the story before Radish showed up. Uh, nope. I think. What all did she need again? Oh, uh, I think she wanted some fish and apples, Dad. Oh, yeah, right. Let's just see if we can't find us some apples around this place. I remember Radish going to Cam Kame's house and taking Gohan away. Okay, I'll go look. Gohan sure is full of energy. That's the installation. It's stalling as we play. Shield controls. Kai blast, charge Kai, move, ba 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 ba, boost flight. Vehicle? Wait, Nimbus? You can find variety of items on the field, simply approach an item. 
And you will automatically collect it. You'll have to press circle when you're an important item, though, to collect it. Be sure to collect food items, as they can be eaten as is for stat boosts or cooked as part of meals for support effects. These effects definitely will help you find yourself up against tough opponents, so keep yourself nourished regularly. Don't get too excited and trip over your own feet! Now, where did that son of mine run off to? Safe to say he couldn't have gone that far. <laughs> Hey, it looks like you found an apple tree. I did? Or did he? He found an apple tree? Now, where did that son of mine run off to? Safe to say he couldn't have gone that far. <laughs> Let's try to find one more. What do you say? <laughs> Leave it to me. Gohan looks like he's having a blast. Hey now! Don't go wandering too far! Dad, over here! Over oh, here. here! Wow, Gohan! You're a regular bloodhound! It's K, not Kai. Oh, yeah, we've got plenty of apples now. I will forever Thanks call it Kai. These, Gohan. Kai Blast. Right. Oh, Key. Key Blast. I call it Kai. Tired now, though. I get it, and I don't blame you. Hang in there. I got an idea. We'll catch some fish and then head straight home. Okay. But first, we need to find a spot to fish. Okay. Don't walk too fast. You got it. Try to keep up, though. Can I pick him up? <laughs> go on, please. You're a saint. That's a big bird. Where'd he go? <laughs> huh? Go on? Where'd he run off to? Yeah. He's right huh? there. What's wrong, go on? I'm tired. I can't walk anymore. <laughs> Man, you get tired pretty easy, don't you? <laughs> I guess I can carry you if you want. Yes. Hooray! Value! <laughs> Yay! Look how high I am! Hey, you perked right up. Were you trying to trick your old man? <laughs> You're one spoiled kid, you know that? I can't run. What do you want to be when you grow up? Hmm. Um, I want to become a great scholar. Lies. What? You're a weird one, aren't you? <laughs> well, I definitely can't help you with your studies or anything like that. <laughs> but if you're ever looking to toughen up, I'm your man. Nah, uh, fighting is too scary for me. Come to think of it, this is your first time fishing, isn't it? Yep, it is. All right. Then let me show you how I used to do it back when I was your age. It'll be fun. We should be able to catch something here. All right. Let's get started. But what are we going to fish with? We don't have any rods. <laughs> Nobody said anything about a rod, did they? Who needs one of those pesky things when you've got a tail? My... my tail? I can use that to fish? Yep. By dipping your tail in the water, you can feel the fish moving around. Pretty neat, huh? It's really easy once you get the hang of it. I mean, 
I haven't done it in a while since I don't have a tail anymore. But when I told my friend Bulma about it, she actually made me a makeshift tail to fish with. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> nice! Oh, okay. So what do you say? Let's catch us some fish. I'm pretty sure there's a good spot somewhere right around this place. Is the bait you like to use? Holy crap. Are you sure you want to use this bait? Sure. Fish are gathered at the fishing spot. <laughs> That's weird. All right. Where did he put it? She'll flip when she sees this one. Man, all this fishing is really working up an appetite. You know what I mean? Let's eat some of these fish. I mean, we've got plenty. Yeah, I'm a little hungry too. <laughs> Let's roast our catch over the fire. What do you say? I'm hungry for some grilled fish. Okay, time to grill up some fish. Oops. One percent to Kai defense. Party HP and Kai have been completely restored. Man, I'm stuffed. Is there anything better than some fresh fish in your belly? Oh, I think I ate too much, though. Well, if you want to be as big as your dad, you're going to have to eat a lot of this stuff. <laughs> right. I had fun today, Dad. You know... I had fun today, too. Thanks for your help. I'll teach you how to fish next time so we can do it together. Okay. I can't wait. Soul emblems. We got a lot. Soul emblems are items that represent relationships with certain characters and can be obtained as you progress through the story. All of your soul emblems that you've obtained can be viewed on the community menu. Soul emblems don't do anything by themselves, but by setting them... To a community board, you can activate effects that will help you on your adventure. You got Z Warrior community leader Goku and unlocked a new community board. Community boards are where you set your social emblems. Emblems can be set or removed anytime, so if you get your hands full on a new emblem, don't forget to set it to a community board. To set a soul emblem to a board, press X on the soul emblems menu and select the one you want to set. A community's rank is influenced by the overall community level of the soul emblems you have set. Once your overall community level reaches a certain value, the community's rank will increase and you'll gain access to more of its community skills, which provide helpful effects on your adventure. As community's overall level is dependent on the community level of the soul emblem set to it. It's also possible to lower a community's rank by adding or removing emblems. All emblems have community levels that affect the community to which are set. Emblems will be all suited to the community I'm setting them certain community increases community level. And I think I got it. <laughs> In this community, you can activate community skills that will help you in battle. Build up the Z Warrior community if you want to focus more on battles. With an empty panel, select X to display the emblem screen. Uh, so I have an empty one. Press X. After selecting Gohan, press X to make him available to set. Set Gohan next to Goku. I did. There you go. I 
bet you'd be pretty strong if you trained. Uh, I don't think so. Time bonus and I are doing ultimate father son team. Placing specific assignment bonus next to one another will activate what's called a link bonus. Activating a link bonus raises the community's level and makes it easier to raise the community's rank. Press the touchpad on the community board screen to view a list of available link bonuses for the emblems placed on the board. Oh yeah, Dad! I meant to tell you! I found this while you were fishing. I don't really know what it is, but... The longest pause yeah, ever. You can have it! Really? Thanks, Gohan! <laughs> Sacred text of martial arts. Give the item Gohan found. A soul emblem's friendship and proficiency also can be gained using gifts. Raising an emblem's proficiency will increase the community level that the community is affected will depend on the gift given. For example, the sacred text of martial arts increases the level of the Z Warrior community. Friendship loses how characters perform in battles, so be sure to make use of gifts that you have. Here's the gift. Take the text. Yes. Community has gone up to rank 2. Talk to go on. So, should we head home now? Sure. All right. Let's head home. Right. Here goes. Flying Nimbus. All right. Hang on tight. <laughs> Whoa! It's a dinosaur! Bye-bye! <laughs> so you are a special item you can find in the field or win from battles. Any you find on the field can be collected by approaching them from the side. From the side, okay. And they are essential for requiring super attacks, so make sure you collect as many as you can. There are many different types of Z orbs. Orbs of certain color can be found in your areas related to that color. For example, blue orbs can be found by water, green orbs near your forest, and if you're looking for Z orbs of a specific color, head to the spot with a lot of that color. Okay. Flying Nimbus is super fast. I've been riding this whole thing since I was just a little kid. Only those with a pure heart can ride it. That explains why you've got no problems there. Yeah, this is fun. Babo ba. Something tells me we're gonna be a little late. Your old mom isn't too mad. The, you're making me nervous, Gohan. Hardy, what's up? Welcome back. Ba, ba, da, ba. Uh, I wasn't ready. I was flying to the orbs. Hey, Chi Chi, we're back. And we got food. She looks mad. Hi, Mom. You're late, Goku. It shouldn't have taken you so long to gather ingredients. Yeah, sorry about that. We did some training, too. You're supposed to introduce Gohan to Master Roshi and the others today. Wait, that's today? Of course. <sighs> Sorry about that. I promise I'll remember next time. We'll get it. What are you waiting for? Get in here. I need to get cooking right away. Her voice sounds off to me. <laughs> if you have fruit, meat, fish, or other ingredients, you can get them cooked by Chi Chi or by other cooks. Eating cooked dishes provide special effects such as boosts to stats and temporary support effects. These are called meal effects. Every dish has its own list of necessary ingredients with richer dishes requiring rare ingredients. More extravagant full course meals provide even greater effects. You can't cook them right now, but you'll be able to as you further on your adventure. All right. I can walk in. Goku, where do you think you're going? I'm not done yet, so just sit tight. I got right. I got a train. I can't wait to dig into mom's cooking. 
You just ate, fatty. Now then, I'll just take these ingredients and whip you up something tasty. Uh, make a full course meal. Well, maybe not. Like a dish. There we go. Select boiled fish. How come boiled fish isn't the number one choice? Oh, okay. <laughs> fish lightly boiled in spices is packed with flavor and real hit in most culinary circles. Where are you off to now, is this game hard? I have no idea. We just started. <laughs> Where are you off to now, Dad? I'm going to see Master Roshi, my old master. His place is surrounded by the sea. It's loads of fun. Oh, yeah. All right. Search the house. Oh, wow. That looks so old. Am I that old that it used to look like that? To put his new students to test, Master Roshi throws a stone on which he wrote the character for Turtle deep into the woods. He states that whoever finds the stone and brings it back first will get to eat dinner, while the other will go hungry. This is when they were training, yeah, I remember that. Goku finds the stone, but Krillin tricks him and steals it away. He then rushes back to receive his meal, but an unexpected trap is waiting for him. This the marked stone. stone. Me and Krillin used in our training. Me and him had to hunt this thing down. Krillin beat me then, but only because he cheated. I had to go hungry that night. <laughs> I could really go for some food right about now. Get the box lunch from Chi Chi. Tell me more. Trophy! Did it. Did the hard All trophy. Right, I'm finished. Here are your lunches. Dig in whenever you're hungry. Thanks, Chi Chi. Your stuff's the best. It really gets the blood pumping and the muscles moving, right, Gohan? Yeah. Took community leader to Chi Chi and unlocked a new community board. In this community board, you activate community skills that will help you cook. Focus on cooking community if you want to be a better cook. Alright. Later, Chi Chi. We're off to see Master Roshi. Ba, ba, ba. Wait a second. Are you forgetting something, Goku? Right. I yeah, they do. Something for Gohan. Oh yeah, that's right. Whoa, what a neat little ball. That little ball on top there? It's a Dragon Ball. I got it from my grandpa after he died. But that's not all you got from him. You were also named after him. Really? Oh my, Gohan looks so handsome. It'll be like he's watching over you whenever you wear that hat. So take real good care of it, okay, Gohan? Yeah, I will. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. All right, we're leaving for real this time. Goku, don't let anything happen to our little Gohan. And Gohan, be on your best behavior. He wears that hat for like, Mom. what, Bye. two episodes? <laughs> A good hat. <laughs> I was happy when it didn't come back on his head. It said there are seven mystical orbs capable of granting any wish when brought together. With them, anything the heart desires can be attained, whether unfathomable riches or absolute power. This isn't the Dragon Ball Z narrator. Wish -granting orbs Who's this guy? As the Dragon Balls. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. These Dragon Balls that this extraordinary story unfolds. What? With new challenges and adventures awaiting Goku and his friends at every turn. It sounds so deep. 
Remember him having like a louder voice, a higher pitched voice. Hey, Dad, what's Master Roshi like? Well, he looks like a feeble old geezer, but he's super strong. Really? Though it's a real shame he's kind of a massive pervert. <laughs> yeah, he was my rival at the time, but now he's my best friend. Is Krillin strong, just like you? Yeah, seriously. Out of all the guys I know, he's definitely up there. There's also a woman I know named Bulma. See, she was looking for the Dragon Balls when she ran into me. And we ended up going on adventures together. If we hadn't done that, I probably wouldn't have met Master Roshi and the others. I see. Not too much longer until Master Roshi's place. I wonder what everyone's been up to. Goku! Yo! Oh, and who's this little guy? Me Yo! Your son. What? Your, your son? Yeah. Wild, huh? Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, nice to meet you too. His name is Gohan. Gohan? Oh, so you named him after your grandpa, huh? Yeah. Suits him, don't you think? Their lips definitely, I think, are meant for the Japanese. Their lips were like still moving after the certain words. Goku, have you been training lately? Well, not as much as I want to. Chi Chi gets pretty angry if I train too much, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, I haven't trained myself either. With Piccolo taken care of, things have been pretty quiet. Hey, you two, what are you talking about? Uh, uh, uh nothing really. Hmm. I could have sworn you two were talking about how you've both been slacking off on your training. <sighs> Guess there's no fooling you, is there, Master Roshi? It would seem you've both forgotten that training is a daily activity, not something you do only on special occasions. You should be moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. That's the way of the turtle school. I can't argue with you there. Now. To make sure you two never forget your daily training, I've got a little challenge for you. You unlocked the Turtle School Training Manual. Come report back to me once you've finished your training. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Now, time to get back to my usual enjoyment. You got Adult Community Leader Master Roshi and unlocked a new community board. In this community, you can activate community skills that aid in earning Zenny. Build up this community if you want to fill your pockets with extra cash. Can I put him with... In my community? Oh, he's got his own community. Okay. Okay. Venture to a blue pillar on the field or speak to a character with a blue icon above their head to initiate a sub-story. Completing the sub-story will net you XP. Valuable items and soil emblems. Some sub stories can only be completed at a certain time, so make sure you do them when you can. Some stories can only be completed with certain characters. If you're having trouble completing a story, listen to the hints provided and change characters. Yo! Hmm. <laughs> Uh, 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 something's up. Are you hiding something? Dag nabbit, he went and hid in my book again. That's Master Roshi's voice. I don't know what he's talking about. He's gone. Oh, hey, Goku, have you seen that blasted turtle? Tortoise? Yeah, he ran off somewhere. Tortoise, are you seriously still calling him that? You know, that's not his name, right? But, but never mind that. What about my book? That pain in the butt hid my book somewhere. What kind of book is it? Is it really that special? Of course it's special. It's my most prized possession. If I ha if I don't have it, then I... I uh, help him find the book? Sure. Gonna find his porn magazine. 
Well, if it's really that important to you, I guess I could help you find it. Greetings. Really? That's mighty kind of you, yeah. Goku. So what kind of book is it? Uh, it's uh, my swimsuit f photograph collection. <sighs> Man, you haven't changed a bit, have you, Master Roshi? I searched the attic. You look outside. Yeah. You got it. I gotta take care of some stuff first. Goku and Bubba help a lost turtle return to the sea. To show his gratitude, Turtle introduces the two to the turtle. Turtle Hermit, Master Roshi. Master Roshi rewards Goku with the flying Nimbus and Bulma with the Dragon Ball that he wears around his neck. Ball of Darkness, what's up? How you doing, man? Yeah, the the pictures are really cool of the old TV show. What? You mean that Jesus filthy book? Like I would know. Well, uh, then you know where I could find Tortoise? If you're looking for Tor er, Turtle, I saw him heading toward the back of the house. Hey! Hey, Tortoise. So where did you hide Master Roshi's book? Oh. It's Turtle, Goku. You should know that by now. I'm sorry, but I can't tell you where the book hmm. is. Master Roshi's read enough of that thing. He needs to learn some self-control. And that's why it belongs in the ground. The ground? Wait, he buried it somewhere? He took it and threw it on the ground! The dirt here looks like it's been dug into. Take a closer look? Yeah. You doing alright? That's good. <laughs> Aha! Here it is! You found the girly book. Yo. Hey, I found your book, Master Roshi. <laughs> Oh, you found it. You're the best, Goku. Yep. I knew I was right to take you on as my student. I'm counting on you to help me out when that troublesome turtle hides this again. <sighs> uh, yeah, sure. D metal. Look, book for grown-ups, energetic fish, herb. Are you gonna be like Master Roshi? What? Looks like that did the trick. Helping hand. What's up? Hey Goku, I know Master Roshi was talking about it before, but you know, training is pretty important, huh? When I get old? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I think every guy gets like Master Roshi. I can't let all the strength I've, I've gained just go to waste, so I'm planning on getting back into a serious routine. Right. So what are you saying is, you want to fight me? You? Haha, <laughs> maybe some other time. I'm gonna focus on some mental simulation training first. Mental simulation training? Oh, you meant you mean where you do it in your head? You should try it sometime when you get a chance. You received the medal from Krillin. This? <laughs> I guess you could call it a training keepsake. Oh, okay. Yeah. The great thing about mental simulation training is you can do it anywhere you want. <laughs> like this beach, for example. All right. Training Grounds has been unlocked. Executive Energy Blast. A manually aimed Kai Volley with homing properties that make it easy to connect hits. Can be used against multiple enemies. Let's go. Bang. Defeat Krillin. Press square while guarding to send a nearby opponent flying. This is called a burst. Burst can cancel your opponent's actions making a great evasive maneuver in a pinch. Press X while guarding an attack to quickly maneuver behind your opponent and send them flying. This is called a vantage attack. This uses up a lot of Kai, but it's a great way to launch a counter attack. Keep the pressure on your opponent by using bursts at close range and vantage attack distance. Don't roll button. To dodge an attack close range, press X just as the attack is about to hit you to perform step maneuver. Your opponent will enter a slow motion state, this making a perfect chance to launch your counter attack. Additionally, successfully dodging an attack will fill your attention gauge. Dodging will help you offensively, offensively, defensively, and in terms of movement, so it's an important skill to master. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 
Dunzos. You found power. <laughs> you like executive energy blast. Cool. All right. That should be enough training for now. Maybe I'll talk with you guys a little bit longer. A long overdue reunion. So he's got your looks, but does he have your power too? I'm betting that he's pretty strong if I had to guess. But I can't be sure since Chi Chi won't let me train him to find out one way or the other. What have you been doing the whole stream? Uh, we beat Devil May Cry 5 today. And now we're starting Kakarot. Damn good, thanks man. I'm ready. Let's continue the story. Hey, Dad? What was that? Hmm, not sure. Son Goku, the strongest fighter in the world, leads to a happy life at home with his new family. Having been blessed with a child, Goku makes his way to Kamiya House, where he attends to introduce his son to his teacher, Master Roshi. Good old sound effects. Farmer. Yep. What is it? It ain't no meteor. Dude, that dude's got. Man spread. Just as I thought, the creatures on this planet are still alive. Kakarot's failed us. Uh, who or what are you? A power level of only five? What trash. I got banned from a stream yesterday because I said, hold up. Hold up, I gotta get my pamper changed. That's weird. Someone's sensitive, I guess. this planet can muster well now here's a large power reading distance 4880 Kakarot <laughs> what in the world could that have been I've never felt a power like this. Press L3 while flying to boost at fly high speed. Boosting consumes Kai, so keep an eye on your Kai consumption as you boost. Your Kai will automatically recover when you stop boosting. By pressing L1 on the field in mid, -fight, mid flight, you can detect the Kai of nearby animals, plants, and other living things. Use this feature to find items, animals to hunt, dinosaurs, key items, food, training. Training ground locations and more. This is a great way to easily find a variety of far off things or something specific you're looking for, so use it when you can. While moving on the field, press L1 to search your surroundings for Kai and detect where enemies are, how many there are, and where they're facing. Where they're facing. Use this to get info and jump on them to or avoid fighting them altogether. You can also gauge your enemy strength based on the color of their Kai. Blue is weaker than me, just yellow is the same, and red is. Get away from that shit. Okay. Kai Blast. Use L2 to enter first person view while in this view, press square to fire Kai Blast or hold the button to fire a charge Kai Blast. If you hit an animal with a Kai Blast, you'll stun it and make it easier to catch. If you also hit terrain and other obstacles to collect materials, try hitting a variety of things on the field. Airways. <laughs> uh, lots. 
You can find special wind tunnels called airways in every area. Traveling through airways is a great way to collect Z orbs. You can enter one by touching either the entrance or any point along the tunnel. Once you are in, you'll automatically be carried through it by wind. You can exit airway by a boost flight, but you won't be able to enter one while boosting. Phantom airways are rare airways that appear in the field. They not only contain more Z orbs than normal airways, but are rare types of Z orbs in and items. However, they will disappear once you leave the area, so if you find one, make sure you ride it while you can. Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. There's a ship. It isn't Goku. Super um, Piccolo, Super Nothing, How to Require Nothing. All right, we're out. Whee! But if it isn't him, then who is it? Well, now this could be fun. Guess I'd better look for more. Is red. Now, this could be fun. Hi. Where the hell could he be? I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. So that's all, huh? Got him. This power, it's unlike anything I've ever felt before. Well now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's Where'd he come this. from? Looks like it's a spot a spot for silver. Damn, just ain't my day. Oh here it is. That was the button I was looking for. Who are you? Huh? What do you want? I ain't the greatest move right now. I make one wrong turn, I end up driving the damn car and all the treasure I stole off a cliff. I really screwed up this time. Yeah you did. Wind tunnel. You did defeated Android too. <laughs> oh really? There's orbs everywhere. This way. Waterfall. Well now, this could be fun. When was Piccolo obsessed with waterfalls? Well now, this could be fun. Go up. Oh, that's the button for up. Got hold because I said hold up. I gotta find my fart bag. Wait a minute. This is a Namekian, isn't it? What the hell is a Namekian doing on this planet? If that's true, then what are you even doing here? You got a death wish? You've got spunk. I like that. Hmm. A power level of three twenty-two, huh? 
You're definitely stronger than the others, but you wouldn't even be a warm-up for me. You're making a mistake in underestimating me. Let's see if you can make this fun for me. You can guard against attacks while holding L2. Even if you're taking damage from an attack, you can start guarding right away and take as little damage as possible. Guard for too long, however, and you'll eventually have your guard broken, leaving you defensive and some time avoided by this by alternating between stepping and guarding one year defense in battle. I need a charge. Close up. Beat him, I got S. Level up. That all, huh? Is it my turn now? Time to show you what real power looks like. <clears throat> I'm getting another large power reading. That's got to be Kakarot. <clears throat> Possible. Who the hell is this guy? And where is he going? Arrivingly suddenly in a strange pod from outer space, a mysterious man with a tail just like Goku's make an unexpected entrance. Shortly after landing, he handedly defeats Piccolo, one of Earth's most formidable fighters. <laughs> well, if it isn't Kakarot, you've Grown. You look just like our old man. What? Tell me, Kakarot. What is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time? Huh? Who are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You have got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine, then. Allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying! That can't be true! Long ago, you were sent to this pathetic planet to rid it of all life. We say and search the universe for habitable planets and wipe out all who live there so that we can sell those planets to the highest bidder. We snot-nosed brats like you are sent to low-level planets like this. And fortunately, it looks like this one's got a moon. Uh, if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait, what about the moon? What does that have to do with anything? Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. 
Even chumps like you should know that. Eh? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, I think Krillin's right. You guys are the worst. My name's Son Goku, and I'm from Earth. Take your lies and get out of here. <laughs> well, I couldn't even if I wanted to, because Planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Uh, including me and you. There are only four Saiyans left. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you. Kakarot, the planet is as good as ours if you join us. Come on, Kakarot, think of the fun we'll have. Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? Just shut up. If you think I'm joining you, then you're dumber than you look. Huh. Fine. Be that way. That little runt with the tail behind you is your kid, right? I guess I'll just take him instead. Huh? Come any closer and I'll knock you sky high. Back off! <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere with you! Uh with this guy. You're not my brother. You're nothing to me. What's wrong? You scared? Yeah, come on, get out of here. Oh I did. I did. What the hell happened to your tail? I had it cut off a long time ago. Oh, why would you do that? Yeah, here goes. And do you know who? This planet isn't half bad. I think it could serve as our next target. The three of us Saiyans should be able to rid this place of this dead bone in just one month. Your kid's in real trouble if this is the best you can do. S. to take good care of the boy. If you want him back, then you better do as your big brother said. Give him back! And don't even think about trying to be a hero. <laughs> no! No! Bulma! You still got that dragon radar? Oh, I get it! That decoration on Gohan's hat was a dragon ball! All right, I'm off! It's now or never! You're as good as dead on your own! Piccolo! Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. How do they not sense him? We tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle in all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture. I finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. Guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely. Boys. Uh... 
S for sexy. All right. All right, time to go. Wait, Goku, take this with you. Here's an item. A Veda drink. What's this? It's a quick acting recovery drink. If you're ever in a pinch, take a swig of that. Try setting a recovery item in your item palette. A Veda drink. Register the palette. Uh, X. Sure. Thank you. You better not die on me. Enough. Let's yeah. go. Right. After progressing to a certain point in the main story, you will begin to travel with and fight alongside other characters. These support characters can assist you in a variety of ways and battles, so don't forget, they're here to help. You can have a support character perform a super attack assist in battling by holding R1 to open the support palette and pressing circle X square or triangle and use the attack to set that button. Afterward, the icon will darken and you will have to wait a little while for, the, for them to attack again. Using a second super attack assist will also fill the support gauge for that character. When a support character's support gauge is half full, the character will automatically perform an assist and help you offensively, defensively, or in another way. What type of assist can it perform depends on the style. There are three different styles. Additionally, the higher the character's friendship is, the higher the capability of the support gauge will be. A capacity. Giving a support character gifts from the community option and so the screen will increase their friendship. Offensive support characters will prioritize attacking the opponent over anything else. They will chase after opponents you've knocked away and perform super attacks in coordination with your own. Defensive characters will take actions to protect you during battle, including hindering enemies' attacks and blocking enemy Kai blasts. Special support characters will restore your HP and Kai. They also have a slight chance of chasing after enemies or hindering their attacks like offensive and defensive types, respectively. Cool. You can now move to other areas in the world map. Access the world map by pressing triangle on the area map screen, moving to the edge of the field, or by flying high into the sky. The following information is available on the world map. Attainable stuff in sub stories. Go on, just a little longer. Goku, get a move on. Quit messing around. You really don't recall anything about the Saiyans that Raditz clown was going on about? No, nope, none of it rings a bell. It's crazy. I had no idea I had an older brother either. <laughs> I was hoping to milk some useful information out of you for our fight. There's so many orbs. I guess I don't need them all. Alright, it's the world map. Select an icon on the world map to move to the area. Main story destinations are indicated with red pillars, while sub stories are donated with donated with blue pillars. Progressive, progressing through the main story will give you access to more areas that you can visit. Selecting an icon on the world map will display obtainable D medals for that area above the area name shown on the left side of the screen. East Ravine area has been unlocked. I don't see any other stuff. Raditz, a man claiming to be Goku's brother and a member of a warrior race called, known as the Saiyans, promptly defeats Goku and makes off with Gohan. Piccolo then arrives and then the two agree to team up. Wasn't this guy's abilities like na named after the days of the week? Right, right, like Dynamite Monday or something like that. <laughs> you can now fly while playing as Goku. Beagles like the bird, baby, ba 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 ba. Okay. Bridge is massive. His tail's probably his weak point. If 
we can squeeze his tail, he should be vulnerable. That's what happened whenever mine got grabbed. How are we supposed to grab his tail? Hey, I got your tail. And then special beam cut in. Hey, dude, I was about to go talk to the samurai guy. I got his name. Oh, 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 we're going fast. All right, lock on. There you go. There's two subquests. Get off. Stop! Stop! Dude, Frankenstein's here? It can't be Aider? Goku. Is that you? Yeah. In the flesh. Goku. I'm so glad to see you. <laughs> Me too. What are you doing here? Following a lead. Robots are running amok in the area. I came to stop huh? them. You did? Are you itching for a fight or something? I actually hate fighting. But these robots are units abandoned by the Red Ribbon Army a long time ago. I need to stop them. Could you help me out? Hmm. The gentle giant. Double Sunday. <laughs> gotcha. Why is Frankenstein in, in Dragon Ball Z? I don't remember this. I kicked their metal butts since the last millennium. Huh? You don't like to fight, right? Yes, but that's Android 8. What? <laughs> don't worry about me. Fighting robots sounds like fun. I see. Thank yeah. you. Just point me in their direction. Yeah, they're not here. Maybe they're over there. The location over there marked my map. Maybe All over right. there. Roger that. I'll get on it. Yeah. yeah. I guess I better check the map. That village over there looks like it's got some shops. Yo! Dude, it looks like Jason from Dark Cloud. What? Huh? Wait, you're. Well, no. That hair and that outfit? You're Goku, yeah. aren't you? Yep, that's me. Who are you? I am Nam. Do you not remember me? We fought at the World Tournament. Oh, yeah, I remember you from the tournament. So, what are you doing here? I'm bringing fruit harvested in my village with me in the hopes of selling it. My village is quite poor, so I'm trying to earn as much money as I can. Huh, okay, sounds pretty tough. Fortunately, I'm not making very much money. I thought I could sell my fruits for a higher price. I guess I am not much of a salesman at this rate. I won't be able to bring water and food to my Excuse village. Me. Oh, I hate to trouble you, but would you be able to assist me? Sure, you seem like you're in a real bind. Thank you. Oh my, thank you. You're selling that fruit, huh? That what it's no. the taste like? Well, it keeps well enough, but it's flavor well. Gotcha. Yeah, that's gonna be hard to sell. You got anything else? My village is mostly sand and rocks. Look. Whoa, they sure are sparkly. Aha, uh -huh, they certainly are. But this isn't gold or silver, just rocks I dug up when I tilted the when I tilled the land. I bring them with me to give the children I meet along the way. I bet there are some people that buy these. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I doubt right. that. First things first, we gotta find someone here who knows more about this Can stuff. You? Right, thank you. You think this shiny jewel would fetch a pretty zanny? Howdy. All anyone can talk about is that meteorite. Not much else to talk about in a place like this, I guess. I guess. Yo. 
Hey, I've got a question for you. You know anyone who's an expert on rocks? Rocks, I may be able to use the miner. Right. Great mine, taking a look at these. Hmm. hmm, I've never seen rocks like this before. They're certainly not <sighs> gemstones. Oh, really? But I'm sure my daughter would love them. Can I take them off your hands? Well, we're trying to sell them, actually. Oh, I see. My apologies. Would you trade them for this? It's an ammonite fossil. I tried to give it to my daughter, but she thought it was All too right. creepy. Sure, yeah, I'll trade you for that. What's this? Are you sure you want to give it up, though? It seems pretty rare. <laughs> ah, don't worry, you can find them all over the place around here. A lot of city folk come out here and dig for fossils in the rocky area up north. Oh, yeah? I think he was digging for fossils in the rocky area to the north. While you're underwater, there's an air gauge that will deplete and you will die if you do stupid. If you find a group of birds hovering over a spot, dive there to see what you can find. If your air gauge is completely depleted, you will be forced back to the river, so pay attention. So don't drown, you stupid bitch. Okay, I got it. 10 o'clock. And? Yo. Hey there, you looking for something? What? Oh, yo, yeah, I'm digging up fossils. I heard you could find a bunch around here, but I've been at it for days and I'm still coming up empty. Maybe this is the wrong spot. I told my friend I'd find some so I can't just head back empty handed like this. Oh, huh? well, I got a fossil. I've got one. Want to buy them for me? Show them the Amorite fossil. Whoa, that's a real fossil, isn't it? But I don't have any money on me right now. I'll trade you for it then. Hmm, let's see. Oh, I know. Would you trade it for this? A water capsule. You got a food okay. capsule. Well, there's a lot in there. I got what I came for, so I don't need any more. Yeah. It's yours. Great, it's a deal. <laughs> I bet now I'll be happy to see this. When you off? Uh huh. I'd better get this to knock. Certainly not gonna get off. Like less than thirty minutes into a game, a new game that I've never played before. That's for sure. You don't just start a new game and put it down 10 minutes later. Who does that? Might cause some trouble later. Best to deal with this now. Yo! What do you think? <laughs> The shining rocks ended up getting you this. Oh my! Oh my goodness! This is filled with an abundance of food and water. How can I ever thank you for this? <laughs> Don't worry about it. It'd be really weird if you got super formal on me. Haha! <laughs> you certainly messed with Roshi's student, all right. Mm. I had no idea these rocks would be able to provide me this this much. This could mean that there may be a more valuable rocks hidden in my fields. At any rate, I should be getting back to my village with this food and water. I owe you a great deal, Goku. Yeah. Glad to help. I'm going to get going. Please visit my village whenever you get a chance. I'll pay a visit to Nam's village sometime down the road. Bang. I can't charge my kind. Yeah. 
Beep boop. <laughs> That's Rumble, you robo bozos. Noise. All right. Get back to Aider. Yo. I took care of your robot problem, Aider. <laughs> really? Thank you. Unlike you, I've never nice. liked fighting, so I really appreciate the help, Goku. If only if I can give you something in return. Oh, how about these? They're vegetables from the village. I brought extra knowing how big of an eater you are. The carrots and onions. <laughs> they look tasty. Food's the one thing I've never seen Thank to you. have enough of. Thanks, Aider. No, Goku. I'm the one who's thanking you. <laughs> Don't get me all formal on me, Ada. We're friends, remember? Of course, you're my best friend, Goku. We're besties! Alright, now to go get my son back. We, we had to go. Uh... Ada's a great guy. Just like back in the old days. We're closing in on him. Let's head down and move in for the attack. No. He's using a device that tells him our strengths as well as our location. Eat stuff to get stats. Anything, everything in the game's world is meant to help Goku and his friends grow. Experience as much as you can and create your own adventure all at your own. Use boiled fish that you made for you. By using the meal, the characters become stronger. This a power level of seven ten. Where the hell? K Kakarot's kid? No way! Damn, this thing must be busted. What? Another reading, and it's heading straight for me. There's one. No, there's two. With power levels three twenty two and three thirty four, they've come. So, what brings you chumps here? Isn't it obvious? I'm here to get my son back. Where is he? You're hiding him somewhere, aren't you? His screaming was giving me a headache, so I locked him up in there. But forget about the rot. Don't tell me you actually think you stand a chance against me. You fool! You're not even fit to call yourself a Saiyan! Prepare to die! You know, believe it or not, battles aren't just about strength. Oh, that gives me an idea. Man, he's fast. Dang it. If this is the best you can do, then you can just forget about joining us. Yeah! <laughs> 
Nice. That dad go. But <laughs> even with your combined power, you're still pathetic. But considering you weren't smart enough to heed my warning, don't deserve to live. You, you gotta be kidding me. You know what? Since you're going to die anyway, I might as well tell you something. There are two more the Saiyans. The Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. If you've got a new attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku. <laughs> Sorry. I'm fresh out. Lucky for you, I actually came up with a new technique while I was training. Really? A plan? Ha! It'd be easier just to lie down and wait for the sweet release of death. I'm just gonna need enough time to charge up the proper energy for it. <clears throat> gonna need you to keep him busy while I deal with this. Got it. I'll do what I can. Hope you're ready for this. Special Beam Cannon! Huh. You just don't know when to quit. You? Alone? What were you two trying to decide who gets to die first? We ain't planning on losing. Yeah. 
This game ends now. I got an S. I don't know how. I feel like I got my ass kicked. <laughs> his power level. It's 1330. He's focusing all of his power into his fingertips. Damn it! He's got that much control over his energy! You let your guard down! Now I've got your tail! Damn it! When did you? Good work, Goku! Hold on to that tail and don't let go no matter what! Wait! Let me go! I'll leave this planet in peace! Don't listen to him, Goku! He's trying to trick you! Please, please, believe me, brother. I'm begging you, Kakarot. Don't do this to your only family. Elbow in the face, bitch. Ha! I can't believe you fell for it. You might actually be the dumbest guy I've ever met. Don't think I'm going to show you mercy just because you're my little brother. Yes! Yes! That's what I like to hear! It'll all be over soon! <laughs> Don't get comfortable! You're next! Damn, if I try to hit him now, he's just going to dodge it! Boom. Impossible. I, I can't be beaten by scum like this. I can't. <sighs> well, you just were. <laughs> Trust me, Goku won't be dead for very long. What? Didn't you know? This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Uh, damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. <laughs> Everything you just said was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once 
They've learned that I've died. They will come here. How long until then? When? When will they? When do you think they'll get here? Oh, a year. Just one year from now. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two have no hope of beating them. Enjoy what little time you have left. Master Roshi, Krill, and the others will arrive on the scene. Piccolo proceeds to explain everything to them, Raditz's death, and the other say the other sayings, and what happened to Goku. I, I see. That's pretty much it. Come on, Goku, hang in there. It's not like you to give up so easily. <laughs> Krillin, you know, dying is a lot worse than I thought it would be. Uh, yeah, but. Don't you worry. We're gonna bring you back really soon. <laughs> Thank you. Goku. What the? He's gone. Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Huh? Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. Hey, what? Uh, you, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand a chance. Once Goku's revived, Tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him. Chi Chi's gonna be pissed. On a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz, the bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth. For immortality, can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. Well, rather than bad, it's now we're starting the Saiyan saga. You know? The dangerous Saiyan duo began to make their way to Earth. Meanwhile, Goku, having died in battle against Raditz, stood alongside Kami at the entrance to the other world. And that is why I brought him here as he is to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000-mile-long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However... I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully. 
Other than myself, of course. In over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy. So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong, but it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Man a man a what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, um, actually, kind of in a hurry. Well then, if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. Where was Raditz sent? Oh. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right. Next question. Who is more powerful, King Yama or Kami? King Yama? Correct. Of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. Who is judged here after death? Only Earthlings or everyone? Yep. That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an Earthling. Next question. Is there a way to bring back those who have already died? Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? Care to shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, King Yama, I... Whatever. Moving on. Which question is this? The fifth. Oh, shit. Sorry, but that's incorrect. <laughs> huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? Really? Um, one, two, three. Hmm. Of course it was, I. I was just testing you. And you passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Hmm. I heard that, Kami. Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Please forgive me, your husband. You're a liar. It was the fifth question. Boy. He's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. Hm. That's enough of all of this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I King Yemma, I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. I need to save. What we'll call it? Once it saves next.
Time to wake up, kid. You've slept long enough. Huh? Who, who are you? Listen up. Time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you, in case you forgot. Wh what? M my dad's... <laughs> if his friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls, they can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Gohan's Crash Course in Survival. You're whining. Once I'm done whipping you into shape, you'll be tough enough for anything. Got it? So, you're gonna train me? Okay, what do I have to do? You have to live out here on your own, without distraction. I'm giving you six months. If you're able to survive for that long, I'll teach you how to fight. See ya. Wait! It's scary out here! Don't leave me! I think there's more grass in this game than I have ever seen in the show, ever. Just right here. It's saved, right? There you go. What other options are there? In battle slow motion. Hired radar. Turn the hide radar reader on. Oh. Uh, Alright, GG's.